It's a new day in Oklahoma. I was born and raised in McAllister, graduated from high school here. It's part of who you are. You can take the boy out of southeastern Oklahoma, but you can never take the southeastern Oklahoma out of the boy. I think our small towns in Oklahoma are in jeopardy. Not so much just our small towns, but our small to medium-sized towns. Everything has basically been directed towards Oklahoma City and Tulsa, and we've left out those regional commerce centers. We don't have the growth and development there that we should have, and that's one thing I'd like to see if we could change and you know, promote economic development more through the regional commerce centers, the McAllisters, the Muskogees, the Tahlequahs, you know, the Claremores, places like that. Create jobs, you've got to create business, you've got to get you know, companies to move to Oklahoma. We need to create private sector jobs, not public sector jobs. Public sector jobs just take wealth and transfer that to another sector. Private sector jobs are continuous. Whoever started that company wants that company to grow. Those employees that go to work for that company, they earn wages, they earn benefits. They have a community about their, their business and their job that lasts forever. Wayne's always had his own business. He, he's always been self-employed, so he knows what it's like to, to be self-employed, to have to make payroll, to, to work long hours. Wayne has a degree in finance and accounting, and it makes a lot of sense to send someone with those qualifications to Washington because of all the budget stuff that's going on up there right now. We need to go in with a slash and dash approach where we cut and kill the unnecessary and the wasteful programs while preserving funding for the programs that are core functions of government. He's in the legislature for 10 years and been very successful in business. But you know, it takes hard work. He's a farm boy, he gets up early in the morning, he's a hard worker, and he's gonna do the things that need to be done to change some things in this country. We want lower gas prices. Let us drill. Government should be a partner, not an impediment to drilling for natural resources that are readily available right here in eastern Oklahoma. I think this is an opportunity for, for change in Oklahoma and for the United States with Wayne uh, being a congressman. He's always more concerned about, you know, how can I help you rather than what can I do to help myself. He's always that way. He's got a lot of integrity. He's a very sincere guy. Uh, I think I really appreciate his friendship and I know he'll do a great job for the state of Oklahoma and for the country. Wayne Pettigrew was given a 98% pro-business and economic development rating while in the legislature. A proven and conservative leader with legislative and business experience. Wayne Pettigrew, United States Congress. It's a new day in Oklahoma.